how things went? It, it went really well. Um, kind of bittersweet, obviously. I would have liked to have ended on the win, but this is this is just the beginning for me in terms of my running career. But certainly this past week has been one of the best weeks of my life, just thinking about all the different memories that I've had as a duck. And, you know, no matter what, I think these past four years have been an experience that is like no other. So I just feel really blessed to have experienced that. And, you know, not a lot of people Get to get to live like that, having the, uh, so many people around that support you, and it's just it's just very uh, very huge honor, and and it's sad that it's the end, but it's also uh, a lot of great memories. <laughs> kind of, um, I, it, it's just like I said, a little bit surreal, and when when we were just walking out for warm up, the crowd was on their feet and I just feel so blessed to have this community around me like I said everyone is 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 just such a it, it, I was just enjoying the moment you know it's so nice that it was here and uh, today I was trying to believe in storybook endings but it, it, it life that's life it, you can script it all you want but it, it, it doesn't always work out the way that that you'd like it to but I, I know that God has a plan and um, I'll continue to go out there and give it a lot of heart every time I race and I'll, I'll race at Hayward again just not in this uniform so it's 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 hard but I just there's so many people around me and um, it, it's just really really special so I'm trying to savor every moment. Just everything I never I never think about winning or championships or we've won a lot of team titles together and that's always very exciting but it's just all about putting in the hard work every single day and having people around me that support me and I've had a, a lot of ups and downs throughout my career but I wouldn't change a thing because those are what what make everything so exciting and make it make really it, 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 it a good experience so it's I, I'm just very thankful for everything. But today's race, is that where you wanted to try to take the lead with 400? Or? Uh, yeah, I, you know, I was just really, when we got to 800 to go, I was really excited. I was feeling really good, and I was planning between 600 and 400 to make a move. And with 600 to go, I was thinking about going then, and then I didn't, and then I was thinking about waiting until 200 to go, but uh, I I thought that my my theme when I was reflecting on the race this week was that you'll always have another gear, and I really trusted that. I trusted that the crowd was going to give me another gear, and it, it, in this case, I guess the other gear was helping me hold it together and not, I mean, Betsy passed me, but... I, after it, I didn't give up when Abby passed me on the back stretch, but with 200 to go, then I had to kind of be like, okay, um, just get as many points as you can, because the team is obviously the most important thing for me, and, um, you know, I think that my professional career is going to go really well, because I of the things I practice, and it's important to practice that, having a lot of heart every time you race, and, one day the heart and the fitness will be there. I knew that if it, I was to win today, it would have been a huge upset, and um, I knew that the crowd would be behind me, but I guess, you know, I still have a little bit to go before I can be at Abby and, and Betsy's level, but I think that this race and this year really show that I'm right there, and um, I, I really am believing that I'm gonna get there really soon. Did you feel the win when you hit the back straight there? A little bit. Um, you know, my parents were sitting at 300 to go, and I heard them, so that I was more focusing on that than the wind, I guess. But um, you know, like when she went by me, she's just she she's a very good athlete and uh, just really good uh, good fitness. I mean, she's probably gonna win USA's, and um, so it. Uh, I really respect her and. And when I do workouts out here, I try to be like her. So it's interesting that you know I pretend that I, I'm running like her. So it's it's like a, a kind of that balance there. But 
Um, I think that it, I need a couple more years to be at that level in these distances, but that was honestly, we were running pretty slow, but it was, it, the goal was to run the best 5K that I've ever run, and I think that was the best one.